Welcome to this Premier Training revision video that takes a look at VAT calculations. VAT, or VAT, is a tax on selling. In the majority of cases, you will have to pay VAT on everything you buy. There are three rates of VAT. Zero rate, 5% and 20%. At level 2, you'll be expected to be able to carry out certain calculations involving VAT. It's unlikely you'll need to deal with a 5% rate, and so in this video we'll look at the calculations for the 20% rate only. The most straightforward of these calculations is when we add VAT to the net amount. The net amount is the amount without VAT. Let's suppose you're selling goods with a net value of £150. On your calculator, you'll need to enter 150 and then the multiply button and then type 20. And finally, press the percentage button. This gives us an answer of 30. This means that we need to add £30 VAT to the £150 net price. This makes the final price, including VAT, £180. If your calculator doesn't have a percentage button, you may want to consider buying one that does, as this will make any VAT calculations easier. In the UK, it's a requirement that prices are advertised to the consumer inclusive of tax. This is helpful to the consumer as they'll know the total price they have to pay. However, it's not so helpful to traders who want to reclaim the VAT. VAT registered businesses will need to calculate the VAT from the gross amount. Let's look at an example. We'll use the same prices as we used before. The gross amount is the amount inclusive of VAT. Remember that we calculated the gross amount to be £180. To find the VAT amount from the gross amount, we can't simply multiply by 20%. If you tried this, you'd get £36, which isn't the amount of VAT we calculated before. Instead, you must remember that the £180 is made up of 100% net price of the goods plus 20% VAT, making a total of 120%. So to find the VAT amount, we need to divide the gross amount by 120, and then multiply by 20, 20 because the VAT rate is 20%. The answer is then £30, which you'll remember is the amount we calculated earlier. If you're mathematically minded, you may have noticed a shortcut for calculating the VAT amount from the gross amount. If we look at the VAT percentage of 20% and the total percentage of the sale, 120%, you can cancel this down to one sixth. Therefore, if we take the gross amount and divide by six, we'll find the amount of VAT. However, Remember this method will only work whilst VAT remains at 20%. We have just one more calculation to look at in this video. Many businesses use psychological pricing. This is based on the theory that certain prices have a psychological impact. Retail prices are often expressed as odd prices. And there's evidence that consumers perceive odd prices as significantly cheaper than they actually are. For example, £399.99 may be associated with spending £300 rather than £400. The problem with this is that it's impossible to determine an exact price for the VAT. Let's take a price of £299.99. If we divide this by 6, we arrive at a figure of £49.998333 recurring. There are some complex rules for rounding these figures, but at level 2, 
you'll only deal with rounding for business-to-business -business transactions, and other rules will be covered at level 3. While normal mathematical rules would require you to round this up to £50, the VAT rules are different. On business-to-business -business transactions, you always round down. In other words, ignore any of the figures after the whole pennies. So here, the VAT amount will be £49.99. I hope you found this Premier Training Revision video helpful, and thanks for watching.